Hi everyone, so today I'm going to take you somewhere really cool. So on the island of Vitaventura in the Canaries, we are going to go to a town called Coraleca and from there we are going to take a ride in the car along the lane here. So I'm pointing it out to you in case you want to do this yourself and you're on the island. And you drive along this coastal road here, which is what I will show you in a second. It's quite well laid out. And you will come to a place called Popcorn Beach. Now, obviously you can walk to this or you can go by car along this lane. So you can see the lane is actually quite smooth. Just take your time, nice and slow, and you'll be there in around 10 minutes. So you can walk it, like I said, so it's entirely up to you how you get there. But it is well worth the visit, and I would highly recommend it if you are on the island and have time. Now, as soon as you arrive here, you will discover this property. Now, this is private property. And if you look at it, it does have lots of things that have been discovered on this beach. And the owner obviously likes to display them as art. And they do actually look fantastic indeed. So straight from there, you can walk straight down onto the beach. So this is what it looks like and yes it does indeed look like popcorn and if you're wondering what it actually is it's actually white coral that's washed ashore and is mixed in with volcanic rock and sand on the beach the further along the beach you walk the more of this popcorn you'll find bigger lumps of it it's all on this beach absolutely fascinating That's what you call a porous that. That's a cauliflower. That is that is a floater that one. That's a floater. Now if you're wondering how this stuff is actually made, it is in fact white coral, which is a consequence of the mixture of calcareous algae and white sand over a period of 50 years. They grow underwater at one millimetre a year. So if a particular section measures 25 centimetres, it will have grown for 250 years. Some of them are more than 4,000 years old. So you may be interested to know that the coral, whilst underwater, absorbs carbon dioxide from the sea in a way that helps combat climate change. Moreover, the coral is a fabulous breeding ground for different marine species who use the cavities in the formations to store their eggs. There are signs up explaining to you that you cannot take this home with you. So you're here to look and touch, but please do not take it away from the beach. So thank you for joining us today on this short one. I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to subscribe to the channel if you are new here and give it a like and hit that notification bell. Plenty more coming from the area. Thank you. Goodbye.